Okay, next is example two, still in uh, more machine or more model. Draw a truth table for figure two below. Design this design should be use D flip flop. Okay, so we have this state diagram. Okay, that contain S0, S1, S2, and S3. And this is the output inside the state diagram. So for sure, this is a more model. And outside is the input. Okay, by using a step-by-step -step solution. So analyze the figure and transfer into a truth table. So this one, this table, we still using the name of the each state, which is S0. S1, S2, and S3. Okay, so this we just put simply S0, not 00. zero. S1 still not 01. We just put S1 and so on. Okay, for S0, input 0 and input 1. The next state will be S2 and S1. Okay, S2 and S1. For S1, Okay, for S1, input 0 will be, next. the next state will be S2, input 1 will be S1, okay, S2, S1, okay, for S2, S2, input 0 will be, next state will be S3, input 1 will be S2, so S3, S2, S3 and S2, then S3, uh, S3. For S state S3, input 0, the next state will be S2, input 1, the next state will be S0. Okay, S2, S0. And then, how about output Y? Okay, so from this figure, the output only is for S2 and S3 for output 1. Okay, so because of this, this is a uh, more model. So any present state that have S2 and S3, the output will be 1. Okay, S2 and S3, output will be 1, 1, 1, 1. Okay, because this is more model. And then S0, output S0, S1, output 0. So S0, output 0, S1, output 0. Okay, to complete this... Uh, table so we can identify the number of bits okay so 2 power of n equal to number of state so n is equal to number of bits so the number of state is 4 okay 1 2 3 4 so 2 power of n equal to 4 so n equal to 2 bits okay so the number of bits is 2 we can write as q1 and q0 Okay, so from here we can conclude that the possible state are 0, 0 that represents 0, 1. Eh, sorry, it's S0, 0, 1 for S1, 1, 0 for S2, and 1, 1 for S3. Okay, this one. So convert into real truth table. So this, this one is still not complete because this S0 is just the name of state. Okay, actually S0 is 0, 0. So this one. So we write like this. So because uh, every state have two bit, so we name this bit as Q naught and this one as Q one. Okay. So this is a, a complete truth table. Okay. Then example three is draw a logic circle from the truth table you obtain from exercise two. Okay. So we still uh, this uh, state diagram. So after complete the truth table, we have to draw the uh, logic circuit. Okay, by using this truth table, the next step is to draw the K map. Okay, so how many K map we have to draw? So we have to draw one K map for output Y, and one K map for D1 input, and one K map for D0. Okay, so this is truth table from exercise 2. 
So the k map for y is this one, and the k map for d1, and the k map for d0 or d0. So we can get y equal to q1, d1 equal to i bar plus q1 dot n q0 bar, d0 equal to q1 bar n i plus q1 and q0 bar n i bar. Okay. So this is the output, the equation that we get for y, d1, and d0. So by using this equation, we can draw the circuit. Okay, so this is the circuit. So y is equal to q1. Okay, y equal to q1. So this is q1 and y. So we have two flip flop actually, because this is two bit. Okay, two bit. Uh, design the state have two bit only so we have to use two flip flop okay d not n d1 okay so this is a clock so due to this is the first the clock first uh, flip flop that received the clock so the, we can say that this is the lsb flip flop and the name is d not and this is the msb flip flop name is d1 okay and then draw the logic skirt that could that reflect by this equation to complete the circuit okay so this is the answer for uh, example 3 okay next is example 4 draw the truth table and logic circuit for the diagram below use d form. okay still d form. okay so total number of state is 5 s0 s1 s2 s3 and s4 1 2 3 4 5 okay 5 state meaning that we have to use 3 bit q2 q1 and q0 okay so this is true table for present state we have to use 3 bit q2 q1 q0 and also next state 3 bit q2 q1 and q0 okay the output is the input is one bit and also the output is one bit okay input one bit output one bit okay just analyze uh, from this state diagram and transfer to this truth table okay we choose s0 for example s0 for 0 0 0 okay s0 that represent the zero uh, s0 because uh, this is three bit so S0 is actually 0, 0, 0. Input 0 is the, the next state will be S0. And input 1, the next state will be S1. Okay. Input 0 is S0. S0 is 0, 0, 0, 0. Input 1 is S1. S1 is 0, 0, 1. Okay. S1 is 0, 0, 1. Okay, the output will be zero. Okay, the output will be zero. And then this is uh, S1. Okay, this is S1. Input zero still S1. Input one S2. Okay, input zero S1 zero zero one. Input one S2 zero one zero. Okay, the output is. And then S2. S2, input 0, S2, input 1, S3. S2, input 0, S2, input 1, S3. Okay, S3 represent by 0, 1, 1. S2, 0, 1, 0. Okay. And S3. Input 0, S2. Input 1, S4. S3. Input 0, S2. Input 1, S4. Okay. S4. Input 0, S4. Input 1, S1. S4. Input 0, S4. Input 1, S1. Which is 0, 0, 1. S4, 1, 0, 0. Okay. Then... Uh, 
okay so only until s4 so s5 6 and 7 doesn't have in this design so just simply put don't care here for s5 s6 and s7 okay so you have to draw uh, to write the don't care here to help you when you draw the k map okay how about the output okay the output is only one for s4 so due to this is more model so only during present state s4 the output will be one and the other is zero so where is s4 so this is s4 one zero zero is s4 so this output will be one okay one one four s4 the other in present state s0 s1 s2 and s3 is zero okay s0 s1 s2 and s3 is zero so the output will be zero for don't care so we put don't care output okay for free flop due to this is d free flop so just simply copy this next state and paste to the d free flop okay and after that uh, we can draw the k-map so how many k-map we have to draw so four k-map actually up oh, the first k-map is for apple y second k-map for d2 flip flop and third k-map is d1 flip flop and fourth k-map is d0 or d0 flip flop okay after after that you can get the equation <coughs> So you can try uh, draw your K map and then check your answer or equation from your K map. Is it and you get like this or different? So for this example, I get y equal to q2 and so on d2, d1, and d0. So after that, after you get the, this equation, so we can draw the circuit. Okay. So first of all, we have to draw the flip flop, three flip flop, because we have three bit uh, design. So we have three flip flop. Okay, D zero is represented by this kit. Okay, D zero by this one, and D one, this kit. So depends on this equation, and D two, this one by depends on this equation, and Y or output is q2 okay y is q2 okay so complete uh, to answer the exam this example form okay next is a sequence detector okay so this sequence detector is by using the more machine okay what is sequence detector sequence detector is a circuit in which output goes high when a specific input sequence occur okay for example we have sequence detector for output one zero okay so this is the input this is called this is crucial circuit so an output set okay so it depends on the input sequence Okay, for example, this design, this sequel detector design is detect, is to want, want to detect input 1, 0. Okay, for example, we have this sequel number, okay, 1, 0, 1, 1, 1, and so on, I think this 1, 1, 1. Okay, from this uh, many bits, so which one is 1, 0? So, the sequel detector will detect bit sequence one zero and then give the output as high okay so for example this is one zero so the output will be one and this is uh, zero one so zero one one zero one one zero one zero the output will be one okay so this in other words so this from this input sequence so this detector will detect a uh, sequence detector for one zero only okay other than that the output will give you zero if they detect the one zero the output will be one one zero output will be 
one, okay, and so on. So this one is usually represented by a clock with 